Thank you for watching our BTEC Cell Q1 What's in the Box video. First and most important thing, the brains of the operation, our Cell Q1 system controller. On the front, it has a power switch, a light, and a micro USB port. On the back, multiple in and outputs, and a grounding point. To make it look a little nicer, we have a label which can go whichever way suits you, depending on which way you decide to mount the system. And that grounding point I mentioned, very important system controller be grounded, comes with a grounding kit. Each one of our BTEC Cell Q1 system controllers has an ambient temperature sensor, so we provide that and a mounting kit for the temperature sensor. Each system controller does need to be powered. That's typically powered by an AC-DC converter, which we provide, or if your system calls for it, the system can be powered off of the batteries themselves. We provide documentation on how to do that. The next major component are our VTZ3 modules. Depending on how many batteries you have in your string, you get one of these modules for each battery. It measures voltage, temperature, and impedance. Depending on your configuration, you may have multiple temperature sensors, in which case your wiring harness, which connects to this, would have a thermistor. Or in the cases where there is no temperature sensor to be connected, your wiring harness looks a little bit different without a temperature sensor. Each one of the wiring harnesses does have a six point plug which goes in. Ultimately, the wiring is terminated in the field using quick disconnects, ultimately going to the batteries themselves with ring tabs. Depending on your particular configuration, you may end up with what's called a BVI module. The BVI module measures current. It's very similar in appearance to the VTZ3 module. However, the label is different. It has a matching numbered label corresponding to a current transducer label. So it's very important to keep these two together. Each BVI module, if you have one, has a slightly different wiring harness than the other types. And ultimately it all gets connected with communication cables going VTZ3, 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 or BVI back to the system controller itself where you utilize our micro USB cable, which we provide right to the front, and then you can start up the system. Thank you for watching, and that's what should be in the box. If it isn't, please give us a call at BTEC right away. Thank you.